How are you, Sheikh? Alhamdulillah, Sheikh. Go ahead. Sheikh, I have two questions. The first one, uh, uh, I'm going to finish quickly. The first question, um, my son is five years old and he, he is an autistic child. Hmm. Because of his autism, he is not normal uh, child like others. He like he like to play by him own. He's non-verbal. He don't like to play with other kids. You know what his autistic behavior means. So my question: he, the autistic childs, they most of childs they like to play with the dogs mm -hmm. because they are alone and there is some dogs they are helpful for them. We find out from the autistic groups, mm -hmm. other parents, and my son is very interested for the dogs. Are we permissible to keep on dog for him to play at home or not? No, that is not permissible. Not permissible. No, it is okay. not permissible. No problem. And the Nabi sallallahu alaihi wasallam did not make any exception, except for cultivation, for guarding the sheep, for security. Otherwise, keeping a dog at home reduces a huge amount of reward, a huge volume of good deeds which we have earned from our prayers or fasting, it will be removed from the balance of the good deeds for keeping a dog at home. An autistic child and a sick person and a healthy person who need the help and the mercy of Allah. Whenever a dog is at home, angels never set a foot there because shayateen actually live there. You don't want to risk it. In addition to the impurities and the najasa, you know, each time it licks your child or it happens to lick the floor or the couch or the spot on which you pray, it's really prob problematic. Thank you.